So today at Taronga Zoo, we've got something really exciting happening. Our five lion cubs are going out on display for the very first time. We've previously shared them on cub cam and people got to have a really intimate look at them behind the scenes. But today is the big day. Today we get to share our five lion cubs with everyone. The lion cubs are currently 12 weeks of age and they're weighing between 11 and 13 kilos. So they're putting on more, almost a kilo or more a week now. They're growing rapidly. We have mum, Maya, so she is almost 10 years old or just turned 10 years old, and dad, Atto, who's four years old. They're doing really well. For Maya, this is not the first time for her that she's had cubs, so she is a very experienced mother, three litters she's had now. So this makes 12 cubs for her for the region. And Atto, this is his very first litter, so he's a brand new dad learning the ropes with these little cubs. Everything's going really well. We're currently introducing dad to the cubs. We've been doing that now for a couple of weeks. Dad's getting used to having these little tiny things. I mean, they look so tiny when they're near him. He's getting used to having them moving around. It's a big adjustment for him though, to, to go from having a big female lion to suddenly having these five tiny little things and they're all so curious to meet their father. So we've been pre preparing them literally from the day that they were born. So it was a very big thing, that transition from going from the nest where they're just tiny little cubs that can hardly move around. The first transition they had was moving from the nest to the, to the rest of the dens, the holding areas. Then they got to set foot on grass for the first time. When they're about five or six weeks of age, they were out on grass in our holding yards, which is, we have a beautiful off display holding yard, purpose built for this very function, so that when we have cubs, they can get their feet, you know, on grass, get used to different terrain, see the outside world. And just recently, we've been letting Mayer and the five cubs come out of their holding area and stretch their legs around the exhibit. We want to make sure that when they're out here on display today for everyone, that they were going to be confident, that they were going to want to explore everywhere. So we've let them have a few little sneak previews. And maya has been wonderful. She's literally taken them for a walk around the entire area. She's shown them their whole home. So they're now ready to come out and meet everyone today. So for a lion cub, particularly for little ones like these that are only about 12 weeks old at the moment, it's a lot of sleeping still. So they do play a lot and when they play, they play hard, but they play only for a little while and then they are back to sleep again. So they are just little babies. They're going to get more active as they get older, but right now they're still needing lots and lots of sleep. So we're finding that they're sleeping around kind of morning, mid-morning, sleeping throughout most of the day. And this is also the time where they're still trying to have a nice little suckle from mum. She's not too keen to let them suckle still. So Maya, you know, she's, she's done a great job till now, but now that they've got their little teeth, she's not really keen to have them suckling. So, but they may well try and suckle while they're out here on display, so everyone will get to see that. And, uh, you know, I think that they probably will still sleep a lot but we will start to see that sleep lessen and the activity increase as time goes on. Although keeping in mind though that cats do sleep for many, many hours each day. So they're only active for very short periods of time and then usually do a lot of sleeping. So that's pretty normal lion routine. So the cubs are gonna be initially out every day between 10 and 2 p.m. And obviously, again, they are only tiny, so they may well be asleep, but a great time to see them would be close to 10 a.m. when they first come out because I think they're, go they're going to want to be adventurous and wander all around. They'll probably explore for maybe half an hour, 45 minutes or so. Then they'll start to bunk down for another little sleep. And again, they'll have another activity peak in the afternoon. So, you know, somewhere between one and two o'clock, they will start to become active again. Right in the middle of the day, you'll probably find them sleeping. But hopefully, the more comfortable they feel out here, the more comfortable Maya is out here, because she's very protective. But we might find them hopefully sleeping right in the center of our habitat. We hope they're going to use our beautiful big shelter that's been purpose built. But we have to wait and see what Maya chooses for those babies. So the cubs are growing really, really fast and it would be so worthwhile to come back and visit as many times as you can. So come to Taronga Zoo, visit us because as these cubs grow and develop, they're going to be changing, they're going to be getting more active, they're going to be growing so rapidly. The bigger they get, the more active they're going to be, the more visible they will be. So it really will pay to come back and visit us as many times as you can so you can follow and track our little cubs through their growth and development. 